In a world filled with tantalizing treats and delectable delights, one might assume that every blueberry-flavored product would be adorned with the essence of real blueberries. But alas, this assumption shatters like delicate glass upon closer inspection. As shocking as it may be, not all claims to be infused with the essence of these small indigo gems actually contain the real deal. Venturing into the realm of blueberry flavor, one must first understand the multifaceted nature of these delightful berries. Blueberries, as nature intended them, are a symphony of sensory experiences. They boast a sweet, flowery allure, reminiscent of warm summer days, their woody undertones grounding them in the earth's embrace. And when bitten into, a drying sensation dances across the tongue, lending an almost musky quality to their taste while a gentle, mild acidity tantalizes the palate. One might wonder how such a complex profile is captured and then reproduced in a laboratory setting. The answer lies in the extraction of natural blueberry taste from real blueberries and picked from bushes laden with these precious fruits. But there's more to the story than meets the eye. For a myriad of sources can yield the essence of blueberry flavor, other fruits, vegetables, seeds, and various natural sources contribute to this enchanting taste. The heartache of this tale emerges when we peel back the label of many blueberry items gracing our supermarket shelves. A cruel reality unveils itself as we discover that not all blueberry offerings contain genuine blueberries. In their place, artificial flavors, colors, and sweeteners sneak their way into the muffin mixes, snack bars, cereals, and countless other products. Sometimes, even other fruits and liquids stand in for real blueberry magic. These imposters take the form of deceitful blueberry bits and particles, cunningly crafted from sugars and starches, masquerading as the fruit that we so dearly love. There is hope for those seeking authentic blueberry experiences. Enter the realm of blueberry flavor honey. An elixir of nectarous wonder derived not from the addition of blueberry flavoring, but from the ethereal essence of blueberry bush blossoms. This honey dazzles with well-balanced taste and a light amber to amber hue. It becomes an enchanting addition to meads, infusing them with divine essence that only true blueberries can bestow. However, as we journey deeper into the annals of blueberry flavor, an unexpected ingredient emerges. Historium is derived from the fluid extracted from beaver castor glands. This peculiar element found its way into the food world in the early 20th century. Though now rarely, if ever, used to mass-produce flavors, it once held a curious place in the industry. Shockingly, every year, approximately 140 kilograms of castorium are harvested, sourced from the sacks of beavers with each individual beaver contributing a mere 100 to 200 grams. The majority of this harvesting takes place in Canada, as Eurasian beaver populations remain too low for effective trapping. Extracting castorium from beavers involves a process known as milking the beaver. Castorium is a secretion produced by the castor sacs, located near the base of the beaver's tail, near their butthole. These sacs contain a thick, oily substance that beavers use for marking their territory and communicating with other beavers. To obtain castorium, trappers or collectors typically capture live beavers, anesthetize them, and ensure a safe and humane procedure. Once anesthetized, the trapper gently massages the castor sacs to release the castorium. The substance is then collected in small vials or containers. It's worth noting that the use of castorium in food and fragrance industries is quite rare these days, as alternatives and synthetic flavorings have largely replaced it. Additionally, the harvesting of castorium is strictly regulated to protect beaver populations and ensure ethical practices. But fear not, for many beloved ice cream brands like Ben & Jerry's, Baskin Robbins, Breyers, haagen they offer kosher options free from many of these peculiar ingredients. Curiosity, however, may still linger prompting the discerning consumer to inquire about their favorite brand's practices regarding Castorium. The simple call to the customer helpline should lay uncertainties to rest, though. 
You know what's the simplest technique to avoid being deceived by forgery ingredients? Simply purchase fresh or frozen blueberries and incorporate them into your favorite dish. Thinking about it, I should start making friends with beavers. They always seem to give a damn. These are interesting things with Jay-Z.